Okay, so many of you might be having the trouble bringing up the Google Chrome browser where it's not opening or not working. Uh, whenever you click on this Google Chrome icon on the desktop, it's not opening. Even when you search in the window search for Chrome and you try to open it up, it doesn't come up. So for the solution, the very first thing that I would recommend you, right click on the taskbar and choose task manager. Now here you have to assure that there is no file running related to the Google Chrome. So what you can do at the top, you will find the search bar. You can type here Chrome. And if you find any file related to Chrome, then you need to make a right click on it and end task. If you don't find anything by the name Chrome, then you can also search with the Google. So make sure if any file is running related to Chrome and if you find here, then you need to end it. Once you're done, you can recheck. If this fixes a problem, you are good to go. If not, try the next solution. Now make a right click on the Google Chrome icon that is on your desktop. From the suggestion, you will have to choose open file location. This will bring up the new file explorer and here you'll find the Chrome application. Now what you have to do, you need to rename this Chrome here. So make a right click on this Chrome icon here. Choose rename. And you can rename it like Chrome 1, Chrome 2, whatever you want to. So I will just rename as Chrome 1. Once renamed, now what you have to do? Again, make a right click on it. Click on show more options. And then you will find create shortcut option. Just click on it. Click on yes. And now you can close it. So you will find now that there is two icon on the desktop now. The one that we just created and the one that we had before. So now what you can do, you can delete the earlier one. And now this time, if you make a double click on this new Chrome shortcut icon, so you will find that Chrome will now be coming up. So this is a simple fix that you can apply. And I'm pretty sure that most of the people will get the solution from here. But in case if this method also doesn't work, then finally, you will have to completely uninstall the Chrome and reinstall it back. So in order to completely uninstall, what you will have to do, click on your Windows search, type appwiz.cpl and then hit the enter key. Now here, you have to look for the Google Chrome. Once you get it, choose uninstall, click on yes, and it says you just uninstalled Chrome. Now before reinstalling, we have to completely remove it. So right click on the Windows icon, click on run, type here temp, click on OK. Now delete all the file from here. So select all the file. Click on delete. Once done, close it. Again, right click on the windows icon. Click on run. This time you have to type percent temp percent and click on OK. Again, select all the file here. And choose delete. Close it. Again, right click on the windows icon. Click on run. And this time you have to type percent app data and percent Click OK. Now here, from the top, you have to click on App Data from the address box. Then you will find the local folder. Make a double click on it. And inside the local, you will find the Google folder. Double click on it. And then you will find a Chrome folder. Now you have to delete this Chrome. So select it and click on Delete. And now we are ready to install the Chrome again. So bring up any of your other browser like Microsoft Edge. And then you can search here Chrome download. Then you can click on the first website, Chrome web browser, download Google Chrome. Click download Chrome. Click on the download it setup file. Click on yes. And the installation of the Chrome will now be started. So you just have to wait for a few seconds. And after that, you will find that you would be able to enjoy the Chrome without any kind of problem. And once it gets installed, now you can either sign into your account. As of now, I will click don't sign in and skip. Got it. And boom. So now you can see we have successfully installed and we can now enjoy the Google Chrome browser without any kind of problem. So this was the last solution, guys, and this will be 100% working for you. But hopefully the first two tricks will be surely giving you the solution. Please let me know in the comment section which method worked for you. And if this really worked, please hit the like, subscribe, and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.